and girls it's Claire welcome or welcome back to my channel today is Friday December 23rd and we're doing trying everything on in my closet my hair is kind of frazzled but we don't care because we have lots of clothes to go through the goal of this video is not only content possible content for you all but it's to truly declutter my clothes because I have a lot of stuff that I don't wear and a lot of stuff that I just don't feel comfortable in anymore or I never really felt comfortable in but I just kept it just because. So, either I'm going to keep it, I'm going to donate it, or I'm going to throw it out, honestly. I may repurpose some of the stuff because I have kind of some visions for some of the items that you may see. I really don't have an extensive closet, I just have a lot of clothes that I've kept. Um, and I'm realizing that and as I keep seeing these videos come across my timeline I'm just like you know what I'm out for a break this is the time to do it and what better way to bring the new year with appreciating the, the things that you have but also decluttering and getting rid of some of the things that you really don't need and maybe giving someone else the opportunity to use those things and also making room for the new you will receive in the new year so every single item today that goes back into my closet it's either going to be loved or it's going to be listed. So let's get into it. This is the first shirt here. It just says crafting is how I roll. I'm going to keep this because I like to sew and stuff with my grandma. Sometimes we go to like craft shows and stuff together. Second item, we have this plain black tee. I'm going to keep this because I feel like this is a little bit more form fitting. It's still a little loose, but it's like a good fit. And I don't really have any plain black shirts or any plain shirts at all because I wear a lot of graphic. All right. Next item is this Mickey and Minnie shirt I got from Five Below last year, I believe. It's fine. It's a little crusty. I think I might wear it to the family Christmas party this year. So, then we have this shirt. It's very basic. I actually got this for free as a gift from a place I went to for my... 15th birthday? Yeah, for our 15th birthday. Last year, I keep it because I wore this shirt every other day. In the summer, it was just something really chill to throw on, so I'm gonna keep it. We got this whole shirt. This is definitely too dingy to wear out, but I do wear it as a sleep shirt occasionally. But, I don't know. I feel like I've definitely gotten my money's worth out of it. Another tee I got from Five Below, it was five bucks. I don't know, and then like the like armpits are stained and all that. I could wear it as a sleep shirt. Some more, but I don't know. What do you think? I like this shirt. Um, she's she's not helpful. She she keeps everything. Next up, we got this unathletic club shirt. I really like the shirt, so I'm gonna keep it. It's, it gets the yay for me. The fit is still okay. Um, again, I wore this to the gym, so this is like just whatever. There's nothing on the back. Um, but yeah, I'm getting tired of this already. <laughs> Alright, still got a lot more to go, so thumbs up. I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to keep this or not because I'm not, I'm not feeling it. Like, when I tried it on, I was like, oh, this is cute. This is fall. Like, oh, cute, cute, cute. Like, from the top. Like, it's, it kind of eats. Now, now when I stand back here, it looks like I stole my little sister's shirt. Like. And then the back is like, kind of, I don't want to say crop, but it's, I don't know, it's kind of odd. Maybe I'm wearing it backwards, I don't know. But this is, uh, I think I'm going to toss it. Not a little dingy too, but I think it's, I still think it's cute. Oh, so it's nostalgic I think me. I think I'm gonna keep it because I like this because there's different colors on the shirt so you can wear it with different color shoes so that was my logic my excuse to keep it so I think if it goes in dry for a couple minutes I'll be okay I'm gonna keep it next up we have this Wonder Woman tee it don't look right on me I, I just gotta face it like it, it just doesn't look right Next up we have this top. It looks better on camera. I don't feel like it's not flattering in person, but you guys have seen this top a lot, like 
a lot. I definitely got my money's worth out of this. Next up, we have this cute tee I also thrifted. If anyone knows me or knows anything about me, I'm not too good to shop at a thrift store. I'm a habit. If I got the money and I like it and it's in decent condition, I'm a habit. And this was just one of those things. It's actually a workout top. This kind of looks good. Maybe I'll stop by the gym when it heats up a little. But yeah. So this top I actually got for $1. I think this is a large or a medium. You can like take it in on the sides. I won't be doing that because I'm in the gym for a reason. But um, yeah, so it's just kind of mesh, I think, in the back. I think. Shirt, it's okay. I got it from Five Below. I don't really think I need this, honestly. It's going to someone else. Um, I've had this for a while. I'm gonna keep this. Like I said, I go to the gym sometimes. So. I don't have many gym clothes, so I don't plan on getting more unless I'm consistently in the gym. More. So I have. Uh, you're losing me. All right, this is gonna be a keeper. I normally wear a shirt underneath, but yeah, this is gonna be a keeper. Number 19. I've been wearing this shirt for four years. Like I, that's crazy to me. But yeah. It just says Keepers of the Earth at the bottom. I'm gonna have to back up because you guys can't really see. Um, probably still can't see it. That's what it says. And it just has this cute little thing on it. Um, I sometimes just wear this out. I wore this a lot during the summer. So, uh, yeah. This is kind of just like a summer shirt. But it's still not loose. Like, look. <gasps> but yeah, it's like. It's not loose. It's like just if it's better not. I can say that at least. So this is gonna be keeper. Not sure when you guys can see this, but this gives you a glimpse as to what I have to choose from when I get on the camera and when I go places. Cause I don't really have nothing to wear. I, I this is how I live. I, I dress like I don't know. I don't know how I dress honestly. I have like zero style logo here. Everyone who graduated eighth grade from the school on the back. This I wear as a sleep shirt. I feel uncomfortable wearing it out in public because I feel like that's weird to wear other people's names on me. So, I don't know. I'm gonna keep it because it's a keepsake. All right, guys. Next piece, we have this MTV shirt. Oh, I have it on the other side. Okay, here we go. MTV shirt. I did like this shirt. It, it, I got some use out of it. Only thing is, it got messed up in the wash and it's like kind of gross. I think it's time to just give this the, the garbage and yeah I don't know I think it's time to just give it up Bali, that's audible oh this shirt looks kind of good yeah good vibes yeah just vibe and I don't have a lot of green so I'm gonna keep it this is what I mean when I don't have staples because I don't I have one plain black shirt I don't even have a plain white shirt I have a button down that's all I got so I got to get some more plain pieces but I do like this and I think this is nice um, so I'm gonna keep it <laughs> I wore this a lot I'm gonna keep it because I just think it's cute and why not I actually it, it's okay it's not amazing but it's okay it's wearable it's doable and again I don't have a lot of green so yeah I'm gonna keep it I just feel like it's just like Okay, the next item we have here is a crop top. It says black by popular demand. I do have the pants. I'm gonna keep it. Okay, I feel like, I don't know. It just makes me feel old. I don't, I don't like it. And like, it's not very flattering. I don't, I don't like it. I think that's super cute. It's an extra large too. It's just a basic blue tee. I don't really have a lot of blue. I have like zero blue shirts so I thought this was different I got this for a dress up day during homecoming week but it's very basic it's just a jean shirt um I also thrifted this it was a good thrift find I've been wanting a jean shirt for a while so I think it like it fulfills what I was looking for I have about to fall um but yeah I don't know um I probably won't wear it so I think I'm just going to donate it because I don't go to haunted houses, I don't go trick or treating, I don't do any of that so I'll probably just donate it, someone else will wear it and they'll get a good price hopefully for it. Hopefully less than $5 because that's what I spent for it. What do you think? It's so freaky. 
But it's cute, but it's Halloween. I know. Cost. It's scary. On to the dresses. Okay. This is the first dress. I like the top of it. And this is what it looks like. Oh. how it looks um I think it's okay um it's not my favorite but I think it's okay enough to keep but I don't love it, it, it I just I just don't and and I'm not gonna sit here and lie and say that I'm gonna wear it because I don't it's been in the closet like <laughs> it's it's probably has lint on it because it's just been hibernating Okay, this is my homecoming dress. It still fits well. Um, I'm just holding it like this because I kind of forgot how to tie it up. And I don't feel like tying it up because now like I'm about to wear it. This is okay. I, I'm i going to keep it. I don't know when is the next time I'll wear this. But this is the next dress. I don't like it. I'm going to list it. But I'm still going to show you guys. Um, you've probably seen this. Me and my mom have the same dress. Um, I was a little bit shorter, not a lot, but I was a little bit shorter when I got this, so it wasn't as short, but now it is like a shirt, pretty much. So, I think that this is not appropriate, and it's a bit baggy, which I don't, I don't like. It looks like a gown that I try to turn into a dress, to me. So, I think someone with maybe a little bit more curves, and maybe if they actually had something to fill out the dress with, that they will really look nice in this, because I next up we have this plaid dress this i actually got, got one dollar yeah i got for one dollar well, at Walmart. Right. dress and make it into just the skirt i really like it as a skirt i think that that would be just so cute i really do think that it's gonna look really nice next we have this kind of biker look so i'm gonna keep it but just for layering um or with a jacket over it so on to the next Next up, we have this hoodie dress that I am considering just cutting into a hoodie because I don't wear it as a dress and I don't like the way it looks. I mean, it's because I hate this. So yeah, this is what it looks like again. Okay, next item we have is this sundress. Is this a sundress? Mm -hmm. But I think it looks okay. Um, I have it in gray and navy. This was two for, I think, Eleven dollars, I think, at Ross. I thought that was a good deal. I think that it will be cuter as a skirt. I know I say that about everything. You can tell I'm not a dress person, but since the summer will be approaching again, as it always does, um, I will definitely get more wear out of this then. And so, yeah, I think that this looks better. And yeah, you guys may not ever see me wear these dresses, but I'm gonna try to wear them. At least once. At least. But yeah, so that's this is definitely like a summer item. I'm gonna keep it. Let's do this one first. This was gifted to me by my aunt Deb. This is super cute, like I don't know, I just love it. So yeah, it even has the pockets on the side. Oh, they're already unzipped. So, yeah. That's how it looks. No detailing on the back. Um, but, yeah, super cute and very versatile, I think. So, there's that one. I would definitely be keeping this um, until I can no longer wear it. And Viv, and it is in a size 1X. This is super cute. I thrifted this from Goodwill and it is in great condition except my cat decided to claw the back of it so it looks like Freddy Cooper got a hook to my jacket but I'm still gonna wear it because it was really good for seven dollars and I thought that that was a really amazing find so yeah very good condition very good quality love it love it love it back of this is probably one of my favorites that I've ever owned um I think that it's super cute I think that it's like trendy I think that 
it's a good size it's like not too oversized but not too fitted I also really like that it has the pockets inside this was really helpful when I needed to I really don't like carrying a purse so this was really helpful I can fit my phone in here it's not in the case but easy for my phone whatever else I may need inside and it was just amazing love it love it love it so it's from Old Navy and it's the classic wool jacket and it's in a size medium so this should be a much better fit now and I don't remember her even mentioning this to me um, but I have it so I'm gonna wear it and we cannot wear black so I won't be able to wear it to school but impossible in this this could definitely be a costume I think um, there's not really any detail on the back but it does have this really cute little belt I don't think you can remove it but yeah and these pockets, you can actually put stuff in them. Not much, but you can actually put stuff in them. And I think that's cute. Um, where will I wear this to? I don't know. Because this is kind of out of my comfort zone. But, I mean, it's okay. Yeah, I think that's better. So, yeah, this is what it looks like. It actually looks like I have something back there. Which, you know, I wore it during the fall one year. Took some cute pictures. Um, but now, I don't really see myself wearing this a lot. But I'm going to keep it for a little bit longer, and then if I still don't get anywhere out of it, I will dump it. I think it's really cute, and I think it fits well. Now this you have is... to go back on your word. You say you don't have anything that wows you in your closet, and this is the one thing that does. This is the one thing that wows me in my closet. <laughs> so, yeah. Fire, insert fire emojis here. I think this is really cute. I can't wait to wear this. I was hoping that I would get invited somewhere where I could break this in, but I think it's okay. You should. I think this is cute and it actually goes to my ankles. Mm -hmm. I had to make sure not trying to flood, but yeah, I think this is really cute and I cannot wait to wear it. So yeah, so, yeah. so this is how it looks. Um, I got this for a friend's birthday party I was invited to. It was a Y2K theme, so I went with the like. This it's not a tracksuit, but it's kind of something like it. I went with that type of outfit from that. From... Alright, this is the next thing we have here. It has pockets. Uh, originally $19, but I got it for $1. Dollar rack. Would you have paid $19 for it if you had the money? No. No? Other one. I think this one looks better. This looks more like me. But I do like the black too, so I'll alternate between them. But uh, yeah, that's what it looks like. Same concept, same little design in the back. Um, so yeah. Simple to the point. I feel like a farmer. My grandpa is definitely going to approve of this outfit because he likes overalls and stuff. So maybe I'll garden with my grandparents over the summer break. Maybe. Probably not, but maybe. This looks like this is a half jacket. Um, I got this from Five Below. Um, it used to be really tight, but now this, I think I could actually bend it up if I wanted to now. But I'm not going to do that. This is okay. I don't see myself wearing this a lot. I really don't. So I think I'm going to donate this. And I think someone else will get more use out of it than I. Another outfit that I have. I just showed y'all what it looks like on the hanger. Um, the slacks are okay. They're not the best, but they're okay. And then this shirt I really like. I feel like an interviewer with this. It it ties. Um... So yeah, I'm gonna keep this. I forgot about this all in one. I wore it enough. I only wore it a couple times, but I didn't, I didn't really like it the times I wore it. So I think someone else would get better usage out of it. It does fit a little bit better now. And it does have pockets, so someone will definitely enjoy this. Just not me. And it's cute. Um, it is really cute. Okay. I don't know. I like it. I've even wore it to school twice. I don't know. It is really cute. And it does fit me. It's not some of the stuff like floods and the onesies flood. I don't know. Like, I don't really have space for it. But I do like it, so. This one, I'm definitely keeping this one. It's a 2X. I got it from Walmart. I picked this out myself when my mom actually got it for me. And the hood is cute. It's the same print throughout. Oh, someone's here. I'll be back. 
All right, we're back at it. Have the unicorn onesie. This is the last onesie I'll be showcasing today. This is a gift from my sister that I got like a year or two ago. Yeah, <laughs> that's what it looks like, and it has a little tail in the back. But yeah, that's it. Okay, so this is the first bottom. Um, these are some shorts. They are a bit loose, but I normally wear them with a belt. So I think I will keep them. Um, but they have always been loose even before I lost a couple of pounds because they're not my size. So I think I might get my grandmother to kind of take them in a little bit so that they won't be falling off because it doesn't look very good. But yeah, I'm going to keep them. Next are these exercise shorts. I've had these for a while. Um, these are large and... They fit good. They are a little more fitted than I would like, but I'm gonna keep them. Am I wearing them right? Hold on. Yeah, I'm gonna keep these. They're okay. Just basic. They have pockets, so yeah. I'm gonna keep these. Have these Island Explorer shorts that I enjoy wearing. I've worn these a lot. I've definitely been getting lots of use out of them. I think they're still in good condition. Have a little wiggle room, but it's not as bad as the other ones. So I think I'm gonna keep these. Okay, um, they have pockets too. <laughs> I'm gonna be wearing these when I work out. I still don't know what top would go good with these, but this is what the back looks like. It's like a different material, but they're very uh, attention oh, drawn. Well, people will be playing by the mail. Next. Okay, these are the next shorts. These are 20. These are Louise Midwife shorts. Well, they look okay. I, I haven't loved them for a while, so I think it's time to let them go. I got these not too long ago for a buck, so I'm going to keep these. Um, I think these are men's. Being like that, so baggy, but yeah. I feel like I should like play basketball. Even though I don't play basketball, but yeah. Moving on. These are the next pair. As you can see, I really like the green color. I think these are dollar two. And I think these probably one of the best fitting. I forgot what size these are, but um, yeah. So I like these, I'm gonna keep them. Okay, I have these shorts. I'm probably wearing them a little too high, but these again, I feel like I would like play sports in these. But um, these are okay. I've worn them a lot. I definitely wear them during the summer and sometimes I wear them like as like lounge clothes. So I'm definitely gonna keep these. These are good. These are actually, these are actually the ones I got for a dollar from the Walmart's clearance rack. They're okay. I don't. Mm, they're okay. But yeah, I think they're gonna grow on me, especially when it heats up a little bit. But um, these are a dollar, and this is a size large. These they look better on camera, I guess. But I don't know. They're they're iffy because I've I wore them a lot and I just don't I don't love it. I just feel like I don't like it. So I like them. I think I'm gonna give these away and I'll probably find something somewhere another time because I don't like these. And they are okay, but I don't know. I'm gonna keep them and then when summer comes back around, if I'm not wearing them, I'll donate them. They look a little bit better now, but I don't, I don't like, like the crotch is like weird. I don't know. I don't really like it, but yeah. They're whatever. Yeah, I'll, I'll keep them. And last but not least, in the shorts category, I got these from Walmart, again for a dollar. And they're not bad. <coughs> Are they the best? No. But will they get somewhere at least next summer? Mm -hmm. They will. So, I think these are large as well. So yeah, that concludes the shorts. Okay, this is the first skirt. This is a pencil skirt. Um, this is a large. Love and it. I think I think that I would be keeping this because I was able to thrift this and I think it fits well and it's like just a basic black skirt. It's a good length because a lot of skirts like don't go this far down anymore. 
and it has a little spoon in the back but I think that it fits good and it's gonna serve the purposes I need to serve so I'm gonna keep it piece is a faded glory skirt in a size 16 I still think this looks all right is it becoming faded yes but do I wear this a lot yes another great thing about this is that it's actually a skirt, so that's really good it, they don't really make those a lot anymore so yeah but I like it and I think it's I think it's okay and I like that it has a drawstring so that's that's always good next okay next we have this yellow skirt it is cute but I don't know I think it's time to just let it go <laughs> it looks so much better now too I think I'm gonna get away because I'll, I'll find more skirts and again I'm not really a skirt type of girl but I have other skirts as you all see and moving on recent purchase um just a plain jean skirt i think this is super cute i cannot wear it too i cannot wear i cannot wait to wear this rather i think this is really cute um it has a split as well like the pencil skirt and i just think that this fits my style i feel like i can dress this up or dress it down i just feel like it's a really good piece i was able to thrift this this is liz claiborne size 14 and i just think that it fits well it doesn't need alterations and it's an all around good piece that i will wear so i'm definitely gonna keep this all right, this next skirt I got for a dollar from Walmart. I don't like it, um, but yeah, not for me. I'm gonna pass it. It's by the brand A New Day. It's in a size large, and I think that it's very nice. I think that it's very modest, and I just think that it's all around decent buy for however much I paid for it. I think that this is good and I think it's gonna be really um, nice to wear as I start going to more like church events and things like that and I think that it's really nice and it doesn't show too much it's a good length and it's black which is really good some cargo pants faded glory they don't go all the way down they're like capris I don't really know how to feel about them because I do like them and I think they are somewhat stylish but I just wish that they were all the way and I think they would look better if they were full length so they're kind of still in the shorts category so I think I'm going to give these away because I think I want to invest in some cargos that actually fit me like all the way down and yeah then we have these. I actually got these from Five Below. I think these are a large. They might be extra large. I think these are large. And I just think that they're like a basic pan. I think they're cute. Um, yeah, I think they're okay. And I feel like they look good because they go, well, it's like about the ankle. It's not always all the way to the ankle, but they go a little bit further down. So I think they look better. And I think this can just be paired with some different things and I just like the neutral color of them and I think that they will hold up a little bit longer until they get too dingy to where I have to discard them. I'm gonna keep these. Okay, these are extra large. I tried these on a little bit ago and I don't love them. I really have tried to like not get rid of these but I bought them and I thought they were gonna look better than they did and then I tried them on I was like eh. then I lost a couple pounds and I'm still like eh. so I think I'm just gonna get them away. Oh I just noticed oh no never mind. Alright I thought they had slots of them. Yeah I don't think they <laughs> I said it about a lot of stuff but I'm gonna give them away say they're comfortable and basic and I wear them a lot and I'm gonna keep them so yeah keep them. things I don't love them but they are my work pants so I'm gonna keep them I need to get some black leggings and I'll probably get rid of these once I get those but yeah Basically, I think I would like to take them and make them into shorts. How they go with my body, rather. So I'm gonna give these away. 
haven't worn these in a while. They're still not as fitted as I would like them to be, but they do fit better now. I can't say that. Um, they are just like button up on the side. They're gray and black. I had another pair in black. I don't know where they are. But I took all the pants out of my drawer and some other stuff I have. As cute as these are, I think I'm going to hold on to them for a little bit longer and if I still don't wear them, then I'll give them away because I don't have as many sweatpants as I thought I did and I just don't want to give so much stuff away and then end up having to like, go back. I just want to have like adequate amount. So I'm going to keep these for now. What do you think? These are extra large, these are Aeropostale sweats, and as much as I did like them, I got them maybe last fall, maybe, but I really haven't worn them a lot, and they got bleach, unfortunately, so I just feel like it's like tacky, and they don't look very nice, they feel better than they look, so I think that I'm just going to depart with them, and I think I'm just going to throw them away, because I wouldn't want any bleach sweatpants, so I'm not going to even send them to possibly get distributed further so getting trashed on to the next okay these pants are 3x and i don't hate them i don't love them but i think i will keep them because they're not bleached and they're in good condition and they have those like pops of pink um it says visit scroot farms uh Scranton, pa so, yeah, it's okay. Don't love it, don't hate it. It's just smart. I'll keep them for now. Alright. I don't know what size these are, but they don't, they still don't feel like I haven't found that perfect fit sweatpants and a brand that I can, like, not be self conscious purchasing from. So, I'm gonna keep these because they, they go all the way to the ankle and. They are okay, so I'll keep them. I don't wear them a lot because I just feel like I don't have anything that could go with them. But maybe I might just wear like a white top or something from now on and just see how that goes. And I might wear it more. I might get more use out of it wearing it that way. So I'm gonna keep these for now. Okay, so first, these aren't really jeans, but these are pants. These are, um, Mom calls them corduroy pants, but I don't know what category to really put these in, but these are brown pants, and I never really wear brown. They, the tension work, and I feel like they are cute, and I like that they are actually fitted and not falling off of my waist for once, so that's really good. I'm going to keep them. Okay, this next pair of jeans are from the brand Terran Sky, found at Walmart, and I believe that these are a 16. I like the way these fit. I think they're cute. I just wish they were a little bit longer but again I'm still gonna keep them because I just think that it's a really cute fit and I just think that they look really nice with almost any top I have so I like them and I'm gonna keep them yeah 52 they are ripped especially on this side so I can't wear them to school oh how I wish I could I just wish they were just like a little bit tighter but I think that's a relaxed one and I, I like that so that's good I'm gonna keep them These jeans are a 14 from Lynn Bryant, and I've had these jeans for at least three years now. I think I bought them in 2019, so 2019, 2019. I've had them for three years now, and they've held up really well. They are very good quality. They go all the way down the foot, and I'm gonna keep them because I don't have a reason to dispose of them, and they were very expensive, and I'm gonna keep them. So yeah. These are still very good. They still fit. Next up are these jeans. I don't remember if these came from Walmart or Fashion Nova. I don't remember. But these are 17 and I think that they give me kind of a vintage vibe. Kind of a little bit of retro. That's what they kind of give me. I haven't really worn these a lot but I was able to thrift them which is really nice. And I think that I will get some more use out of them. Um, just not right now. I have to think about like what look am i really going for and kind of envision some more with these jeans <coughs> then i have these these are like my mom jeans i like to call them 
um, I have really gotten a lot of wear out of these. I was able to thrift these as well. Um, like I said, I'm not against thrifting. I'm open to thrifting. I just give them a good wash and they're good to go. Um, they're still in very good condition. They are a little bit short, but it's okay. They are 16 by the brand JMS, just my size, and I really do like the fit. It's relaxed, but it's still fitted enough to where I don't really have to put a belt or anything with it, so I do enjoy wearing these, and I've worn them a lot, and I'm going to wear them a lot more. These are the jeans. I'm definitely giving these away. <laughs> thank you so much again for watching i hope you guys have a lovely day uh whatever time you're watching this and yeah thank you for watching bye guys